Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Silent and welcome back to my Red Dead news series. In this video, I'm going to be going over all of the new content in this week's Red Dead Online update. There's an opportunity to get yourself some free treasure this week, along with some new bonuses, and also a couple of pamphlet discounts that are definitely worth um, paying attention to, so I'll be going over which ones are actually worth buying in today's video. I think with the Casino DLC being released on the Tuesday this week at the same time, a lot of people weren't actually aware there even was an update into Red Dead Online. So up first, let's go over how to get yourself some free treasure. So Rockstar are going to be giving away a free treasure map to anybody who completes three daily challenges in a row. So this will be a three day daily challenge streak. Now to keep your um, daily streak going, you only need to complete one of your seven uh, daily challenges per day. So you can check the list, find the easiest one each day and just complete them three days in a row to have a three day streak and you will have unlocked your free treasure map. So this is a super easy one to unlock, it will only really take you five to ten minutes to complete one daily challenge. There's usually always a very easy one such as eating meat or selling feathers that you probably already have collected in your satchel anyway. Moving on to discounts, there's a couple of nice discounts at both the fence and the gunsmith, so there's 25% off the Incendiary Buckshot Pamphlet, the Small Game Arrow Pamphlet, and also the Potent Predator Bait Pamphlet. At the Gunsmith, you can also save 25% on the Studded Explorer Gun Belt and the Sharp Shooter Gun Belt. Since it's on sale this week with 25% off, I'm going to be purchasing the Incendiary Buckshot Pamphlet. This one allows you to craft incendiary buckshots yourself, and they are a lot of fun to use. I've seen some people asking online if the small game arrow pamphlet is worth it to craft small game arrows. They basically give you a 3 star small game pelt um, when you're hunting. They're not worth a whole lot of money when you're getting perfect small game um, animals, but they do fit in your satchel when you're hunting so it can help you increase the amount of money you're making for each hunting run you're doing. So if any of you guys are big hunters or spend a lot of time hunting in the game, this might be one to consider. But if you don't hunt too much and you only do it now and again just to pick up some supplies or uh, meats if you want to cook them and uh, refill your cores, it might not be so worth it to purchase that one. So let's move on to the new clothing items. They added another ridiculous hat, exactly what we need more of in Red Dead Online. This is the Fanned Stove Pot Hat for $133.25 or 6 gold bars. The Urban Coat is now available for $131.75 or 6 gold bars. Next up we've got Gibson Pants. These aren't actually a new item, the next two clothing items are just a couple of new tints that have been added. But these are available for $60.50 or 3 gold bars. And last of all are the Blackburn Boots, $87.25 or 4 gold bars. And again there's a couple new colour tints available for these. This week in Red Dead Online, there's also a 30% bonus on both Red Dead Online cash and experience for completing free roam events. There's also a 30% bonus XP when you're playing in a posse on all activities when you're playing either in a temporary or permanent posse when you're playing in free roam. So this is a nice opportunity if you are playing around in free roam anyway, you might as well make sure you're playing in either a permanent posse or a temporary posse just so you get that 30% extra bonus XP. Rockstar are also offering 50% off the cost of purchasing a permanent posse this week so instead of costing $200 this week it's only going to cost you $100. If you guys haven't already I totally recommend purchasing a permanent posse and that way when you're playing online and you don't have anyone else to join as a posse you can just join your own posse you can complete daily challenges with it and there's some other nice perks of playing in a posse so definitely pick that one up this week while it's 50% off. If you guys do enjoy these update videos I'd really appreciate if you could take a few seconds to leave the video a like, help support the channel and also subscribe so you don't miss out on any future breaking news and updates especially about this summer update which we would hope is going to be coming sometime August. So don't forget to turn notifications on so you don't miss out on any news for that. Thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you in the next video.